Now this right here is a very bad sign. This is the Guru's detecting mobile, okay? That means that the Guru has absconded with my scoop. He's on the beach using my scoop. That turkey. Well, so instead of uh, going to hunt for him, I'll go back home and get me uh, another scoop. And head out somewhere. I'm, I'm an hour and a half late. The tide's already made off low. I had some damn honeydews to do this morning. Plumbing problem. You know, plumbing. I hate that plumbing. God! But I finally licked it. Two road trips and parts. It was a simple thing, but plumbing is just not simple to me. Nor is algebra. Stand by. Well, I went home and I got my uh, grave digger scoop. I'm going to use it. It's heavy. But I had it fixed, you know. But it works good. I changed coils. I put the 5 inch coil on so I can work around these rocks up here. And I'm going to set this baby up. I think about like I've been using it. Yeah, that's good. Give her a spin, see how she works out. Stand by. Like I said, I'm two hours late. And we got a little breeze, but I'm gonna work right in this little shallow slough area right through here. Where I've hunted several times before with you. We'll see how it goes. It's a nice day, it's sunny, it's about maybe 50, I doubt it, but close to it. Stand by. Seagull! I gotta go sit down here and make an adjustment in my uh, thing. This little five inch coil is going crazy today. I gotta turn the sensitivity down. Rock, the rocks up here, you can see, are almost as bad as they are at the other end. Some, some, some places they're actually worse. There's a lot of little finer rocks up here. There's a lot that size up here too. This is what the real estate looks like. A nickel, you see it? Five nigger cents. But you've got tons of these little rocks. But the stiver scoop, see, they fall out. This scoop, they stay in. But I found a couple of little small tickets today, too. I'll show you to you in a little while. It's hard to work this big scoop and gloves and a camera. But that was a good sound. I thought it was sighting. It was a nickel. But I can't tell the year yet. Stand by. See that nice pull tab? Oh boy, nice pull tab. Now, that's a lot of stuff I got in there. I think scoop's half full. Some little rocks. That's why you need the right kind of scoop for the right location. If the guru didn't have my scoop in action, I'd have it because of the holes being bigger and these little rocks would all fall through. But I'm hampered. Most of the time I don't really pick it up and look at it. If I see a lot of rocks like this, I'll dump it out in a clear spot and swing back over it. I just wanted you to see what it looked like. So well, here it is for about 90 minutes. That's all I can get in today. Looks like a gas cap. A couple of pull tabs. Bullet. Copper. Two pennies. Some kind of spring job. Air, air tap. Air cap. I don't know what this is, but it made a good sound. Brass, looks like. All these little things would have fell through my uh, stiver scoop. Did I miss anything important? 
I got a cool nickel. I showed you that nickel. It was green. I cleaned it up. 1954. See how this macro works in this baby. Let's see what I do. I'll push this down. I ain't too impressed with that. Stand by. Yeah, that's a little better. Nineteen fifty-four. That's the best of it. Oops. I'm watching a video, of Dreamland Boy, on my uh, while I was working on my stuff here. See you tomorrow somewhere. I think I might be going back to the same exact spot I left from today. That ain't bad for. I mean, I didn't find nothing exciting, but was, I wasn't there long, so. I got a feeling you'll see me there tomorrow. See you later. Good luck. Shut up, Scooter. That's my whiny little cat. <laughs> She's hungry. She just came in.